good afternoon y'all welcome back to my channel happy saturday i'm filming this on a saturday but i don't know if you're gonna be watching this on a saturday but um i am going to be filming or trying to film in public today this is my first time actually filming in public so i'm actually really nervous i'm not gonna lie to y'all but i only have to do go to one place today and let's go to target i'm walmart i need a new laptop um I had a little Chromebook that I got back in 2020 and my kids broke it. So I need a new laptop. I am I have multiple things I need to be doing. I need a laptop. Rocking with my phone has been cool, but I definitely need like a bigger place to to search and do all of that other stuff. So what else? I need to go grab the other things, but I'm going to take y'all with me. So I'm going to show you guys what I'm wearing today. I'm going to be completely honest and transparent with you guys. I have my cycle and um, yeah, I'm not feeling it today. So... I like for my pants to be slightly tighter during this time of the month because I don't know I just had this weird phobia of like me just excessively bleeding and it's just I get inside my own head at times please excuse me but I try to dress with a lot more compression in the bottom area if that makes sense um, so I have this bucket head on because I have locks the new growth is new growth and, and it's getting real thick and stuff it's time for me to get a retwist so um that's what we rock with the bucket head and it's a little bit sunny outside so it kind of helps this shirt don't remember where i got this shirt from but it's a nice like little breezy material it's like 70 some degrees where i'm at so it's not too hot but it's not too cold and then i also have these pants i can't remember where i got these pants from i don't know if it's like tj maxx or ross or whatever but they're super flattering and they're super comfortable and they're stretchy but most importantly they holding you down down here <laughs> so um yeah so that's pretty much it and then i'm either gonna wear my black and white bands or my croc my little croc slides i don't know but this is what we doing for the day um super chill not doing too much because like i said we only have to go to one place which is walmart i just have to get some small stuff the main thing from walmart is a laptop but i also have to get a potty for my daughter because she um this morning she took her diaper off. She's about to be two in July. So I'm kind of sort of thinking that that's her way of telling me like, you know, she's getting ready for potty. So I want to get her some panties from there. And then I want to get uh, a little potty for her. And then I, I made a list, so I'm not just going in there grabbing stuff, but I'm gonna take y'all with me. Again, this is my first time filming in public. So like I'm low key scared, but not scared. I just don't want people to be like, why you got that camera, what are you doing? But I'm going to push through. I'm going to show you what my kids are wearing, too. I dressed them real cute, real cute. Okay, um, Bryson, come on. Come show the camera what you're wearing today. I say hi. This is Bryson. He has on some basketball shorts. Let me, let me stand you up. Come back here. So he has on these. This um, this is a, like a plain black t-shirt. I got this from Walmart. And then these basketball shorts, he's had these for years. He's just now growing into them. And then you're going to wear your new shoes. Uh-uh, get down before you knock the camera down. You're going to wear your new shoes today. Those new balance that you got. Huh? Wait. Yeah, you're going to wear your new shoes. That's why I dressed you like that. Okay. That, I'm going to walk. And if I see dog poop, I'm going to walk. Wanna right show the, you want to show the camera your shoes? Yep. Here's the camera. Nice. You got your some new balance. Back up right there. New balance. Brand new. Okay, you're going to wear those. Braylon has on her cute little top from Granimals. These cute shorts that I got her from Granimals. I'm actually going to grab some more of these. These are super, like, the material is really nice. And they come in a bunch of colors. I ordered these when I did my Walmart Plus order. But um, I only ordered, like, two colors because I didn't know how they would fit her. And then she just has on these Puma Bye. running shoes. Super cute super comfy like i said it's 70 degrees today so i try to dress the kids breezy my kids get hot easily they be sweating some more stuff so i try to dress them comfortably so they don't be doing too much i'm gonna see y'all when we get to the store we have secured a laptop i'll show y'all when we get home I'm grabbing some stuff for the kids because I have to table train the kids all over again. So, we got a table and we got all this stuff so that they can eat at the table and make it a little bit fun and make them want to stay at the table. Got some wipes down there and then I got these for little mama. 
just as like her starter panties. I just got one pack. Are those just... bibs? No, these are panties. Pants? Ta panties, toddler briefs. I'm trying to get her a little uh, booster seat for potty training, but I don't really see them. I may have to ask for help because that's the last thing on my list and I gotta get some hydrocortisone and then we can get the heck out of here because this Walmart is crowded. We were in the line for laptops for like 30 minutes. So I don't like being in the store. If you know me, you know I am an introvert. I stay in the house <laughs> and I do all my Walmart orders online. But the reason why I wanted to come in the store because I told y'all it was because of a laptop. The last time we ordered a laptop offline, they canceled it because the laptop wasn't in stock, but online it said it was in stock in the store and I'm not trying to wait three and four days to ship. So I found this one, I don't know if I want to get her this one or this one with the polka dots. This one seems more girly, it looks like this. So I think we're gonna grab this one. It's the last thing we need so we can get the heck out of here. Y'all, we came home. As soon as we walked outside of the Walmart, look. When I'm talking about thunder, lightning, look at my clothes. Soaked. <laughs> get my pants. I don't know if y'all can tell, but my pants are soaked. I'm about to go change. Okay, so I changed out of my wet pants. It's thunder and a little bit of lightning. But what I got from McDonald's is their blue raspberry. good yes and then I just got number seven which is the two double cheeseburgers and two cheeseburgers and a fry but we didn't eat the fries and I gave some compression my lift driver he was so nice typically when we do like lift and stuff they don't help you like they just be walking they be like watching you struggle but and I got the car he was like, hi. I was like, hi. He was like, do you need me to help you? I was like, yes, please. We didn't have a lot of stuff, but it was the fact that he asked, and it was pouring down rain, and so I was putting the kids in the car, and he put all our bags in the car. He was super nice. So, five stars for me. I'm about to eat. I always add mac sauce, and because we was in a hurry, I forgot to add mac sauce to my sandwich. So, if you eat at McDonald's, because I know some people hate McDonald's, and they will never eat there. I will never eat McDonald's. Good for you. Anyway, <laughs> but if you do eat McDonald's, if you get like a double cheeseburger or a bacon McDouble, depending on where you are and what your McDonald's sell, add max sauce to it. I promise it's going to make it a 10. Got some honey mustard. I'm just going to dip my sandwich. Or I could just put it on it. And the girl at the McDonald's, she was super nice. When she was taking my order. And I was like, every time she asked me, I was like, yes, please. Yes, right, yes, please. And she was like, dang, you say please a lot. And I was like, I'm sorry, it's a force of habit. She was like, no, I'm not saying it in a bad way. She said, but you just made up for all of the rude customers that I had because people were being rude to me today. And I was like, well, I'm sorry that that happened to you. She was like, "You, but you made it better. And I was like, thanks. So be nice to people because you never know. It's the smallest thing, make people day or make somebody happy. So, yeah. But I'm about to eat. Okay. <laughs> So the last time I picked up the camera, I think I was eating lunch. I had to change my clothes, y'all. My clothes were drenched. Braylon is sitting like right next to the camera. So if y'all can hear her super close, she right there. Um, so this is the uh, soft potty hopscotch bread. I got this from Walmart, as y'all saw in an earlier clip. I can't believe it's time for her to start potty training. Like, man, kids, they go up too fast, man. Anywho, um, she is one, she'll be two in July. So, yeah, but I got this for her as her like little starter thing so she can hold on to the sides of it just to put it right on top of their, um, the toilet in their bathroom. And then I just grabbed her one pack. Uh, when I first started potty training my son, every time I went to the store, I grabbed him a pack of underwear. So he has like a hundred pair of underwear, which I think is a great tip like for parents, new parents, first time parents, whatever the case. Like every time you go to the store, just get like two, have two of each like age range. Um, I was on this side. So this is 2T3T. My daughter is shaking the table. Um, she is a little bit bigger than her normal size. She's only one going on two and she's already in the 3T clothing. She on the chunky side, like chunky baby girl. I believe this specific pack was 5 dollars 
And these are the Toddler Girl Briefs, 2T, 3T. Um, just something to start off with. And they're nice and cute. Um, little different little patterns for her. And it comes with six pairs. So that's what I got for her. And then uh, the laptop I told you guys I was going to get. So I had seen a little teeny tiny Chromebook. And the I wanted a Chromebook for a multitude of reasons. Um, first, I wanted it because it's small. I could just toss it in my purse. My everyday, my everyday purse is a tote. So I was like, something that I could just throw in there if need be. Um, nothing too crazy, but they didn't have it. My last laptop that I had is a Chromebook. And that one was, I got that one back in 2020. And that did me really well until my son wastes water on it. My son wasted water on it. So I thought I was wiping it up as fast as I could. He continued to watch it. I think he was watching YouTube or something on it. And then the next day I had went to go log into it. And it, it wouldn't come on. It had a lot of important stuff on it. So I was kind of sad. I still have it. I told y'all I was going to show y'all for size comparison, but it's in a closet that I just cleaned up, so I'm not digging in it. So I think that Chromebook was like 10 or 11 inches. It was shorter than a ruler, so it was pretty compact. So the lady there, she told me about two different laptops, but we ended up going with this one. I got the HP 14-inch laptop. It is the Windows 11 in S mode. Um, four gigabytes, 64 gigabytes of storage until and they, she said they didn't have it in pink. They had it in blue. So I just told her it was fine. Um, I told her it was for school because it is, um, getting a certificate, getting an IT certification. They had a lot of blues and blacks and I think blue was pretty cute. Um, this is probably the biggest laptop that I've ever owned. I had a MacBook back in the day, but I didn't like it. So I returned it. I know people swear by it. Apple and people use it like for editing and all that jazz but I had it don't know what all the hype is about I am too tired as y'all can see my energy has changed since earlier y'all I'm so tired it's like when you have children and you take your kids with you in the store it's either one or two things happen they either sleep they're calm the whole time or they're super hyper and I had a mixture of both like well not, not I'm not gonna say they were super hyped this time they were more hyped last night than they were tonight than they were today but it's just the fact that we were in the grocery store for like two hours. <laughs> Walmart. We were in Walmart for like two hours. I'm like, this is going to be a quick little trip. It wasn't. We spent majority of the time securing this bad boy. I was supposed to stop the video. It was still rolling. Sidebar. If you ain't never had these, go try them. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. And also, I ordered... A wide angle lens for my camera for my videos and they arrived but how my apartment complex is is like my mailbox is not like right outside or in my building or at the corner my mailbox is literally like a four minute walk from my house so I'm not and it was pouring down raining as y'all saw earlier and we were drenched when we came in the house so if the kids want to get out the house tomorrow, I'll just probably take them down the hill to go get my lens. When I first ordered the lens, it was the wrong, it was for the wrong camera size. Like it was for this camera, but it was for a different version of this camera. So when I got it, I was like so excited to try it and I tried to screw it on and I was like, this ain't working. So I messaged the seller on eBay because quick tip. If you are just starting out with YouTube, if you already have YouTube or whatever, y'all need to check on eBay for y'all. Cameras, accessories, lenses. Try eBay. Like, I don't know if people still use eBay. I've been using eBay since 2013 and they have never. I bought phones, laptops, tablets, everything you can name. Shoes, clothes, everything off eBay. Check on eBay. I got two brand new camera lenses for $20. But this is a pretty blue. Look how pretty. Ooh. I have some stickers. I always like putting stickers on my stuff. I'm probably just going to see if Amazon has like a cute little case for it. And I'll put it on it. This is too cute. And I got this from Walmart, y'all. And I paid $200 for it. I think somewhere around that. The original laptop that I was looking at cost like $149, the Chromebook. And Chromebooks are gonna be cheaper anyway. The Chromebook that I got back in 2020, y'all, was $100. But it lasted me for two and a half years, so. You ain't got no kids, you good. <laughs> it's like six o'clock, we're about to chill. I'm probably about to set this up. Do everything I need to do to it. 
sign into my school stuff because I am getting a certification. Mama needs some more money. Okay. Okay. Mama needs some more points. So we're getting the certification. Good morning, y'all. It is Sunday morning. It's like 9.45. The postman just knocked on my door and dropped that off. I'm pretty sure that's cleaner that I, that I ordered from Target. And they didn't have any more in stock, so they shipped it to me for free. And my daughter's currently using it as a um stool. So, excuse if I look a little crazy. But we are about to go to my mailbox. Remember, I told you my mailbox is like a four or five minute walk from the house. So, it's supposed to rain today. So, we're going to go walk now and kind of wake the kids up a little bit. Get some fresh air. Check my mailbox. And then we're going to come back. Because I'm pretty sure that my camera lens... My camera lens, I know it was delivered yesterday. But due to the rain, I was not walking back out there with the kids. It's bright and sunny outside. So pretty. So, me and the kids are going to go walk now. Um, so take it. So I'm gonna bring my camera with me. We're gonna go to the mailbox. Excuse me, I look literally rolled out of bed, went to the mailbox because it, my forecast in my area calls for rain, and I really just cannot deal with the rain. We got caught in the rain yesterday. I told y'all, I ordered some cleaning, I ordered the wall light instant clean pet stains with oxy pet stain destroyers. So it has this part on it. Because I told y'all that the kids stained their carpet up in their room. So this is what it got. Which I knew that was coming anyway. I just knew they was going to bring it this early. Typically when the postman comes to my house on a Saturday or a Sunday. He doesn't come until like 1 or 2 o'clock. So when my doorbell rang at like literally. It's 10 or 4. I think my doorbell rang at like 9.30. I was like what the heck. So yeah. And then these are my camera. My camera like this. I'm so excited about this I hope this works okay so this is the kind of camera lens that I got it was a two-pack I think it was either 20 or 24 dollars and they just go right over your lens this one right here is the 2.2 professional telephoto lens high definition multi-coated anti autofocus digital lens with 62 mm filter so the issue before with the other lens is that they didn't fit my camera i hope these fit because if they don't fit i'm gonna be highly upset and this is the wide angle lens i think this is the one that i'm gonna try to put on and see it comes from this little cute little baggie we love we love and then okay this looked like it may fit my camera okay because the other one was really tiny all right i'm gonna try to put it on and then i'll be right back I was a little scared because it wouldn't go on at first, but look, it looks so good. Okay, you see how it's kind of like curved and it kind of gives the video a little bit more definition. And that's just this lens. Oh, I'm about to cry. It's, oh my God, it looks so good. And y'all, again, I only it makes my camera way heavier, but I love it. It just ups the quality so much better. Okay, I low-key want to put this one on and see what the difference is. Okay, so again, just for refresher, this is the 43 mm wide angle lens which it kind of gets more right i think the last time it just kind of showed like up to here but it kind of gets a lot more and it looks it looks so much better okay this is what it is if you want to take a screenshot of it the focus looks so much better you want to take a screenshot of it that's it and I'm going to put the link to where I bought it from down below. So, um, I don't know if it has it. I gotta go back and look. Hold on, I got my phone. Duh, let me look right now. Hold on. The camera that I have right now is the Samsung NX3000. It has a flip screen, Wi-Fi, all of that jazz. So, so he does it for Samsung, for Canon cameras, Sony cameras, Nikon. So, yeah, pretty much all your basic standard cameras he sells the lenses for and when i had to exchange they were really nice super quick about sending me a new one so um yeah highly recommend so you see how it looks with it on let me take it off okay y'all see the difference right you can literally see the difference, right? Like the wide angle 
gets so much more of my background, which I don't know. Most people don't like that effect. I love that effect. So yeah, so this is with it without. I think this may be my everyday lens. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Let me just sit this down on something nice. So I'm going to put that one back on. And let's take this one out. This is the 2.2 Professional Telephoto Lens. High definition, multi-coated, autofocus, digital lens. This is 62 mm. So this one. Oh, this is the filters. So this is the wide angle and whatever telephoto is. It's a two pack. So you ever get in two for the price of one or for less than the price of one, you take it, boo-boo. Oh, so this is literally for pictures. Oh, this one's heavy, heavy. This is how this one looks. And I believe that this one is strictly for pictures. So I will keep this one and use it just for pictures. But y'all see like how nice these lens are. And I literally paid $26. Either tw I keep changing the price. $20, $20, I think it was either $24 or $26. But again, I'm going to leave the link to this in my description box down below. So if you want, you can get it. Okay, so this is just a regular lens that my camera came with. This one. And I'm going to put the wide angle back on. And that's the one we're going to film with until I decide to not film with it no more. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, comment your favorite emoji down below so we know who made it to the end. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, right now, I don't know what my uploaded schedule is going to be because I am pre-filming all of this content. So just trying to get myself like a jump start. I don't know when this is going to be live right now. It's April 23rd. So you could be watching this at the beginning of May. I don't know. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot. And also don't forget to subscribe because that also helps me out a lot. I love you guys so, so much. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.